it's me welcome back to my channel today i wanted to switch up the background again it's a little tilted because the tripod's currently on the sofa but it's okay it's like shifting it's it's art it's art piece it's fine <laughs> i wanted to do a quick story about like how small the world is i have four examples of how small this world just is and we're gonna start with the first one i think we do like the one that's like, that's not that small to like, oh my god, this world is super small. So the first one, I sell stuff on the app Let Go where you can sell stuff and then people message you for it. You guys bargain and you guys, you guys pick a location to meet. And so I was trying to sell actually a, like, uh, a lighting, a light. And I was messaging this person and I'm like, okay, fine. And then she never showed up and then she messaged me and she says, I'm so sorry. Something happened, but I'm coming now, whatever. I'm like, okay, that's that's fine. I'm still here with the item. She comes out. Literally the sweetest, nicest person in history. Um, she comes with her dad, and she, like, gives me a hug. And I'm like, this is so weird, because I, I don't usually do that with strangers. But she was the sweetest person I've ever met. And I was, like, infatuated with her. I was like... I want to be her friend <laughs> and so I looked her up on Instagram because <laughs> her name is unique so I'm like it probably is like one of a kind and I found her on Instagram and the reason why she needs a light because she actually does acting and singing so I was like oh that's so cool like I'm, I'm, I'm interested and then it says you guys have a friend I'm like we have a mutual friend um, and he's actually an actor and I'm like what the hell like She's from, like, I, well, on her app, it said, I think, Diamond Bar or somewhere up there in that area, Pomona. But on the Instagram, it said North Hollywood. So I was, I was even more confused. But we have a mutual friend that's into acting. So I was like, damn. But I didn't have the guts to follow her yet. So maybe I will after this video. Who knows? Second story that's a small world is... Um, I used to work at a school and anytime that I had like a computer issue I would contact IT and this girl would come and she's the sweetest person she's efficient she knows how to fix everything she's a boss and so I was like you know she's cool whatever that's awesome and then during Christmas we get like a two-week break and on my Instagram story, I have a friend from Disney who I fo we, we follow each other. And I see he's on an airplane with his boyfriend and the boyfriend's sister. And I'm like, she looks so familiar. I'm like, where have I seen her? And then I messaged him. I'm like, is that, you know, your boyfriend's sister? Does she work at, you know, Chapman University? He's like, yeah, and IT. And I'm like, oh my god, like, I know her. She's amazing. She's super intelligent. She's so great with technology and computers. She always helps me. She's the most down-to-earth, nicest person. That's his future sister-in-law. Like, what the hell? That's another small world story. And I'm like, damn, that's crazy. You know, that's, that's insane. So that's two stories that's based in California, which you might be thinking, like, California's a small city. Everyone knows each other, whatever. So here's two stories that makes this world super small that might blow your mind because it blew my mind in a sense um the third story is basically um at the disney college program every fall and spring there are new disney college applicants that come in to work at the location and so i was already there for six months so the new ones were coming in for the spring and i don't know how this got started but i think we were both from boston which i'm like that's so cool like i haven't met anyone that's from the east coast yet so we were talking and I, I don't know, she asked me what school I went to, I think, and I said I went to Brandeis University, and she's like, my dad teaches at Brandeis, and I'm like, shut up, no way, and then I said, what's your last name? She said, Angel, and I was like, Angel, Angel, and I was like, is your dad Professor, you know, Robert Angel, um, who teaches financial accounting? She's like, yeah, that's my dad, like, yeah, yeah, I was like, Oh my god, I took his class as a freshman and it was so challenging. He was he was a good professor, but 
the class itself was challenging and also it was a once a week class so it was from 7 to like 10 30 so i was already exhausted from the day and i was like your dad must like hate us because none of us like volunteered to participate in class because it was like so brutal that three hours and um it was a night class and it was a tough class um but she told him and he claims he does remember me um i think i got like a b or b minus in his class <laughs> So that was a really small word. I'm like, what are you doing over here? So we're like friends now, obviously, and we're both still living out here, so that's pretty cool. And she doesn't live too far away in terms of in Boston, where she used, where she grew up. So that's I, I found that such a small world story. But here is the number one small world story that I was quaking. <laughs> so when I was working at Chapman University, I was at the front desk of a study abroad office. And this student comes up and wants to study abroad. So I told her, like, all these options and where to go and, you know, dormitory, how to do this and this and that. And at the end, and I didn't give her my name. <clears throat> and at the end, she's like, are you Steven? And I'm like, yes, I, I am. I'm like, I don't, know how, I don't know how you know that, but yes, I, I, I am Steven. And she was like, I'm, I don't remember her name. She's like, I'm da 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 I'm like good for you, Mike, nice to meet you, I, I don't know you, but I'm glad you know me, um, she's like, I'm Nick's sister, and I'm like, Nick who, she's like, Nick P, I'm, I'm using P to protect the names, whatever, Nick P, and I'm like, from London? So, when I studied abroad in London in 2012, um, it was with the Boston University program, and we, uh, there was only a few students who were like non BU students and I was one of them of course. So I roomed with a lot of BU students and one of my roommates was named Nick. And I guess he his sister is a couple of years younger, obviously, and goes to Chapman University on the West Coast side and wants to study abroad and saw pictures of me and her brother and just connected the dots and I'm just like what is this? And we're in the study abroad office. So I'm like, kind of comes full circle. So I'm like, what? I'm like, tell your brother I said hi and hope everything's all like, everything's well. I'm, I mean, we still follow each other on social media and stuff like that, I think. Yeah. But I'm like, that is just so small. So I was trying to get her to go to London, obviously. But that's four stories that so far just shows how small this world is really is it It really is a small world um it i don't know it's just super small um if you have any stories like that please 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 share i always find it fascinating and interesting i'm like damn that's so cool like i'm so excited about these kind of stories so yeah i get happy about the tiniest things which i think is awesome and easy so yeah <laughs> don't forget to love life live happy and i will see you next time shine on